So this first one, we're going to look at the positioning of the keeper as you approach. So Mikael, over to you. Talk to me. As you want to approach into him right now, he's already modified his position, so he's coming out. Yeah. So the best moment to do it, go back, please. Yeah. Is the moment he's coming. Yeah. Come, 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 and he's not set. That's the moment that you. Ah. So look to strike before the keeper gets into his position. Yeah. So if the keeper is on the move, he cannot react as quickly and efficiently. So when he's set. He will react and he will be more efficient. So you have to try to do exactly the opposite. Attack the keeper. No, really. You cannot touch. You have to attack the goalkeeper. You have to use your body. Always control the one with the furthest feet. Yes. So you can use this one. Take, yeah. So take him away. Position it just like that. Simple. The trigger for you is when I turn. Okay. Now. Oh, good save. Good save. Better. Much better. So this one's working on disguise, so I'm going to pretend I'm going for the far post and go near. We move in here, the next touch is backwards and in diagonal. That touch, if it's straight, the defender can get a foot in. Do another gesture just to fake another fake and one more touch, then he will jump into that. One forward, here, back and back. Ready? Why have I dragged that? What have I done wrong there? Because you are crossing the, the ball is too far on the second off. touch. The ball is too far from you. Uh -huh. So when you are trying to do that, you have no balance. Okay. You shift in your whole ball and bring it back. One, two, and the The angle to be the keeper, yeah. two of you. put the ball high or put the ball across the other. If you put it here, look his hands. He needs to react here. And then put it across. If you pass the ball there, then it's a rebound. That's gold. If you're going to go near post, go high, aim top, because then the keeper has to do that. It's a harder save. Or go lower across, so we're going to work on that. Go. Step to the left foot and then put the ball in the top corner here or across. And I will be arriving there for the back. Okay. That's the one. The ball is in the air, inside the box. A lot of times, the ball goes over the bar. I'm going to head the ball, the ball goes over the bar. No chance to score. You have to hit the target. When the ball is in the air, yes. try to bring the ball back to the ground. And then you have every chance to hit the target. Just make contact with the ground. So I'm going to cross different types. The ball will be bouncing. Yeah. Just attack the ball, always attack the ball, and down. And down. With the head, and down. Okay. And you see. Let's go. Oh, oh, you said down. You didn't say no pins. Mm, but, but this happened. But my aim was to put the ball down. Yeah. What we do with the player, every time you hit the ball over the bar, 500 pounds. Yeah. 
fine. No, I didn't hit the ball down. But I was trying to hit it down and it's gone. 